Hey everyone, Brickhouse here with another video, and the struggles for Disney and Disney properties continues. Um, you know, this weekend is the big opening weekend for The Flash. That's what everybody's focused on, at least that's what I'm focused on. However, there's another movie coming out this weekend from Disney Pixar called Elemental. And uh, it's not looking good. Not looking good at all. This is from Bounding Into Comics. Uh, upcoming Pixar film Elemental expected to have worst opening weekend in company's history. That's saying something for Pixar. The upcoming Pixar film Elemental is predicted to have the company's worst opening weekend in its entire history. Friday reports the film is tracking to have 35 million opening weekend. Yikes. Box Office Tracking Website, Box Office Pro, predicted back in May the film would gross anywhere between 28 and 39 million in its opening weekend and go on to gross between 89 million to 155 million in its entire theatrical run at, at the domestic box office. Ouch. More recently, Box Office Pro predicted the film would have an opening weekend between 31 and 41 million. They would specifically claim it would earn only 33. Even if the film hits $41 million, it will have the worst opening of any Pixar-produced film ever, according to the numbers. The three Pixar films with the worst opening weekend box office are, Tor are Toy Story, 29.1, Onward, 39.1, and The Good Dinosaur, 39.1. And that's all in millions. Really, I didn't know Toy Story was that low on its opening weekend box office. And Toy Story is considered to be a, a classic. However, if you adjust for inflation, the Toy Story opening weekend gross comes into 58.1, onward 45.9, and The Good Dinosaur 50.2. Those are all in millions. The poor opening weekend means the film is likely to be a box office bomb, which seems to be a trend lately for Disney and Disney properties. Given the Hollywood Reporter notes that most Pixar films are believed to cost around $200 million to produce. If the film has a $200 million production budget, it needs to make around $500 million to break even on the conservative side using a two and a half times factor. I usually use double myself, but two and a half times, okay. $600 million if you use a factor of three. See, that $200 million doesn't include the, the marketing and advertising. Which I would say probably another fifty million on top of that. So, because I haven't really seen this movie marketed, like Indiana Jones, like The Flash, like The Little Mermaid. According to the film's production notes, the film is set in Element City, where fire, water, earth, and air reside. Residents live together. The story introduces Ember, a tough, quick-witted, and fiery young woman whose friendship with a fun, sappy, go-with-the-flow guy named Wade challenges her beliefs about the world they live in and the person she wants to be. Film's director Peter Sohn revealed he self-inserted himself and his wife into the characters. I started layering in my relationship with my wife. I'm Korean and she's American, half Italian. I hid the relationship from my parents at first because they, in an old-school way, wanted me to marry someone Korean. My grandmother's dying words were literally very Korean. Um, Sohn would go on to claim the movie is about understanding our parents as people. From that, understanding comes an appreciation for the sacrifices they make for their kids. My parents immigrated from Korea in the early 1970s, so I was born there and raised with Korean traditions, language, culture, and in the very American New York City. That led to some culture clashes along the way between first and second generation. I took for granted the trials and tribulations they've, they must have experienced. And Rotten Tomatoes just crashed my browser Again, for the second day in a row. How about that, folks? Elemental will arrive in theaters on June 16, 2020. And so far, it's gotten a 79% Rotten Tomato score from critics. Which, okay. 
I could, I can see that. Of course, I can't really dig in. Like some people can with the top critics and see the top critic score. So what do you guys think? Are you going to issue seeing the Flash and go see Elemental? Or are you just going to go see the Flash? Uh, for me personally, I'm just going to go see the Flash when I have time, if I have time this weekend. So tell me what you think. Uh, you think Disney is going to keep up their, their momentum of having box office bombs? Do you think Elemental has a chance of making Disney some money? Share your share your comment down below, and if you would take the time, please smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, hit the notification bell to get notified when my content goes live here on YouTube. You can catch me also on uh, Rumble and Odyssey. My videos are available on those platforms also. And uh, as always, I thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in, and I will see you later.